What's up, YouTube? Uh, working on the dually again. I uh, thought I'd make this video for anybody that uh, is working on one of these 6.0 power strokes. It has this same issue. This thing was about to drive me nuts. And uh, yeah, I almost drove me crazy, but figured it out. Perseverance prevails. And if you are working on one of these 6.0s, do yourself a favor get a moving pad. This isn't stressful for you my uh, turbo had a hiss and I was not building any any uh, boost power and so I just done my oil cooler and my EGR is deleted it's welded on both sides but when this turbo pipe back here is connected you barely have enough hand space to get back here to this band clamp if you can see that this band clamp that's all the way back here that goes from the EGR cooler to the Y pipe for the exhaust. There's a washer back there, but the clamp, my old one, let's see, it's right here. It had, had bent outward, so it kind of flattened out. So on this side might be a better, better showing of how it's kind of supposed to look. It's supposed to be kind of 90 degree. But, uh, so I tried to put the new one on there. I was going on with my hand, and for the life of me, I could not get it to work out because I didn't have enough hand space. So, decided to get a little creative. Take this band clamp off of the back of the turbo back here. And then, if you have, I have a 4-inch turbo back exhaust. All I did, because I didn't have a jack, it's in storage right now. All I did is I took a jack stand pushed my exhaust up in the air and then pulled the jack stand up and then stuck it right there and it gave me enough space it gave me enough space to thread to thread the band clamp bolt through there and then put the screw on manually and then tighten it down hope this helps somebody and you don't go crazy like i was about to Keep on going.